This is calculator question number 15 from practice test 7 in the 2018 version of the College Board Prep Book. It's also the October 2016 SAT exam that was actually administered. College Board gives us a word problem describing a proportion, they use the word rate, and they ask us how many one cent coins in this situation it would take to make a stack 8 inches tall. If 50, make a stack 3 and 7 eighths inches tall. I prefer to write 3 and 7 eighths as a decimal, and in my calculator that's 3 plus 7 eighths equals 3.875, and so I'm going to write a ratio, 50 coins over 3.875 inches. They're asking how many coins, I'm going to call that x coins, over 8 inches where x is the number of coins it takes to make a stack 8 inches tall. Now I like putting in the labels for my quantities to make sure I haven't flipped one side of my ratio. Common error is to just flip one of them. Now if I ignore the coins in inches, I have 50 over 3.875 equals x over 8. Multiply both sides by 8 and I get x by itself. So x equals 8 times 50 over 3.75 over 3.875 gives me 103 point something or another and that is closest to 100. Alternatively instead of answering exactly I could have said that 50 coins are about 4 inches so if I want twice the height, 8 inches, I want twice as many coins, about 100. And since none of my answers are anywhere near 100, I know that that estimate is good enough to choose the correct answer. Again, choice B. Come back soon for my next math video with math there's always more.